with this chat GPT prompt, you can write code outreach copy for any industry, no matter what you're selling, whether it's a B2B service business or it's a SaaS company, you can literally write a cold outreach copy for any industry along with seven follow-ups that I'm going to give you today. These seven follow-ups are high converting follow-ups that you'll be getting over here and using ChatGPT, you can personalize that for your industry. I promise that what I'm going to share you today is something that you will never find anywhere. So make sure you stick till the end because there's a special giveaway to a community access that I'm going to be giving you at the end of the video. This is the prompt that you'll be using inside ChatGPT. If you're not aware of ChatGPT, ChatGPT is a free AI technology that's available for everyone. You go to chat.openai.com, create your free account and you get an interface like this where you can put your prompt and ask AI to write anything for you. So here we're going to be using this prompt where we just need to fill in a few blanks, which is from to problem and solution. So the prompt is act as a cold outreach specialist, write a persuasive cold outreach copy to book a meeting. This is where you need to put your description, your company, a little bit of what you do. Here you need to put whom you are reaching out to and a short description about them. Here you need to address the problem of your prospect and here you give the solution. And then this is, you know, the continued prompt, write a copy that addresses the problem, pitch the solution and invite the recipients for a quick call. This cold email copy should be structured like this. So here is the structure of your cold email copy. And then we are telling the chat GPT to keep a few things in mind, which aligns well with cold outreach psychology. And then we are asking it to fill in the above placeholders. So now, as you can see, these four blanks, I've already filled in, in a example. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this prompt, put it inside chat GPT and show you what is the result that we are getting over here. And it's going to happen in like one or two minutes. So you just need to copy the prompt, put it inside chat GPT. Before I hit enter, let me just show you the from to problem and solution that I've filled in over here. So from is SEO agency. We are reaching out as a SEO agency for SaaS companies where we offer link building services. We're reaching out to SaaS companies, their founders, marketing managers, head of marketing, etc. The problem that we are addressing in the cold outreach copy is paid ads are expensive to acquire qualified leads for SaaS companies. And there's a cutthroat competition among SaaS companies to rank for their desired keyword. Solution we have is we help B2B SaaS companies acquire qualified leads through organic SEO traffic by helping them rank for industry relevant money keywords. So the problem is clear, solution is clear. This is something you have to be clear with. I mean, you are running your business, you know what's the problem, you know the solution. So that's something you need to fill in over here and just hit enter, that's it. So let me just hit enter and this is gonna write a perfect code outreach copy for you. So look at this, the subject line that we're getting over here is, uh, boost your SaaS company's organic traffic with our help. We can absolutely work on this subject line. We can ask ChatGPT to give us more variation of the subject line, but let's look at the email copy. I hope this email finds you well. I understand that as a SaaS company, you may be facing the challenges of acquiring qualified leads through paid ads that can get, that can get quite expensive. With a cutthroat competition among SaaS companies to rank for desired keywords, it's it can be tough to stay ahead. That's why I wanted to share with you a solution that's been helping B2B SaaS companies like yours drive organic traffic and acquire qualified leads. Our focus is on link building services that can help you rank for industry relevant keywords and give you an edge over the competition. Would you like to jump on a quick call to discuss the potential of this solution for your company and how it can help you achieve your marketing goals? I look forward to connecting with you soon. Best regards. This is the cold outreach copy that you need. Now, absolutely, if you want to tailor this 
copy for your company you can ask chat gpt to make those changes you can say uh, make it short make it uh, much more compelling i also want to talk about the pricing i also want to talk about how we have worked with uh, few reputed companies you just need to mention i want to talk about how we have worked with reputed companies like hubspot and gpt is gonna rewrite the whole copy for you mentioning how you have worked with hubspot let's just see so here you can see this copy is now rewritten and here we are talking about focus is on link building services that have helped companies like hubspot achieve their marketing goals so now if you want to go in depth on how you have exactly helped hubspot you can give more context to that but as of now i think it's it's more than enough for us to you know take this email copy put it inside our cold outreach software and start our cold outreach but before that we need to have the follow ups ready with us because the software the cold outreach software by gromi organic is going to follow up with the prospect in automation so that you don't have to manually involved in it for that we have another prompt over here which is follow up 1 till follow up 6 and i've already written all the instructions over here so you don't have to make any changes just copy and paste it over here i'm just going to copy paste it over here and is going to write the follow up copies for you so let's see cool so as you can see we have all the follow ups ready over here starting from follow up 1 till follow up 6 let me just read a couple of them so the first follow up is quick reminder about our previous email uh, just wanted to follow up on my previous email about boosting your saas company's organic traffic let me know if you have any question or if you'd like to schedule a call to discuss further so let me just show you the agenda of all the follow ups that i've created so the first follow up is to remind prospect about previous email and we want to keep it short first follow up is to remind the prospect about the previous email The second follow up is to ask the prospect about who's the right person to talk about this. The third one is to tell them that we did a little bit of digging on their company and we think that we are a right fit for them. The fourth one is where we are sending a breakup email saying oh, we understand that this might not be a priority right now but you know anytime you want to reach out you can send us an email. Right? Then the fifth one is uh we want to show a curiosity to ask them that what are the current solutions that they are using to solve the problem that you have addressed in this email do they have a in house team or they are using any external services so that you know we can discuss with them and give them a better solution than their existing solution the sixth one is uh, where we are again sending them a breakup email saying i understand this might not be a priority but if they ever want to reach out you know you are always open to help them out so based on the instructions that we have given to chat gpt this has crafted a perfect cold outreach copy for us which you can see over here now all you need to do to start your outreach campaign is to copy these put it inside gromi organic but here's a bonus tip now this is something which not a lot of people are doing but if you do it your chances of landing in spam reduces and we're going to be using is known as spin tax using spin tax we can create multiple version of our email copy so that every time when we are sending a automated email there's going to be a slight change in the sentences that, that we are putting inside a copy let me just show you an example of spin tax a, a spin tax usually looks like this so if you have a word as hey the spin tax is going to create multiple variations of hey hello hi So every time you're sending an email to a person uh, with this spin tax over here, is going to pick something randomly from this. Sometimes it's going to send as "Hello Anant," you know. Other time it's sending email as "Hi Anant," "Hey Anant." So every time there's going to be a slight change in the email copy with spin tax. Now you can apply this over a sentence, or you can apply this on each and every word. So here I've just taken the words. but you can do it for a sentence as well so now what we want to do is we want to convert any of the email copy in a syntax so that we can create multiple variations of a same email copy now this is optional but it's 
definitely going to reduce your chances of landing in spam because you're not sending the same email to everyone all the time. So if you're leveraging Gromi Organic as your cold outreach software, this is the advantage that you're getting over all the other guys who are using a basic cold email software. So I'm going to copy this spin tax creator and put it inside the copy. All you need to do in order to use the, uh, the spin tax is to paste the copy. And then in the end, you put the spin tax creator chat GPT prompt and press enter. That's it. Now it's going to take the above copy and create a spin text version of the same copy. Let's just see. So here, as you can see, first it has created a spin text version of the subject line spin boost your SaaS company's traffic with organic SEO, discover the power of organic SEO for your SaaS company, get ahead of the competition with our link building services. Here we are getting three different variations of your subject line. Now, uh, here we have a spin text of hi, hello, greeting. Then, you know, we have a spin text of a whole word, which is, I hope this email finds you well, wishing you the best, sending you positive vibes. Uh, if you want to make changes, absolutely you can do that. But you know, this is what chat GPT has created for you. Now here, if we have a word like acquiring qualified leads through paid ads can expensive. The other version is it can be tough to keep up with the competition to rank for the desired keywords. So this spin text copy is ready for you and you can take this, put it inside Gromi organic and set it on automation. Every time this software is sending email, is going to create a different version of the email copy. Let me just quickly show you how that works. So let's say if I take this email copy and I put it inside Gromi organic, I go to Gromi organic. We need to go to the templates and we have already created a folder as SAS SEO outreach campaign inside of this. Uh, here I will be pasting my body and the subject line I can copy from here and paste it over here. Now, one thing to keep in mind that we are using the right macros. You need to double check if the macros format is aligning with the Gromi organic as well or not. So here, if you see on the top, the macro looks like this first underscore name, which is not similar to what we see over here. We need double braces. So we need to convert this into something like this double braces, first underscore name and followed by double braces. So all the macros, you can get it from here. If you change your list, you will be getting different macros. So it totally depends on uh, the list to whom you want to send your email based on the list that you have created and the columns that you have created, you will be getting the macros option. For example, for this list, we are getting macros as email, first name, company website, DA. So yeah, you need to choose that list over here. Cool. So now you can see uh, our copy is ready over here. Uh, our subject line is ready over here. Now let me just show you a quick preview of this. But before that, I'm going to name it as SAS SEO outreach template. And I'm going to save it over here. Now if I click on preview generator, and I choose any of the list. So here we have the first name. That's why we are getting hi and first name over here. Wherever we have the first name as a column, we are getting that. And as you can see, it is taken something randomly over here. Discover the power of organic SEO for your SaaS company. Every time it's sending email is going to create a different variation of that spin tax that you are using over here. So now if you, if you feel the email copy looks good, you're good to go. You create your follow-ups. If you think you need to still make some changes, go back to your editor, make changes until the preview looks good. You can also send yourself a test email just to see if the email copy looks good in your email inbox or not. Once you're happy with the copy that you have over here, move ahead and start creating the follow-up copies. Again, you can see the follow-up copies are over here. I can go back. This is the follow-up one. So I just need to copy the follow up copy one, I will paste it inside here, then the subject line, no matter what you put as a subject line, 
the software is always going to take the first subject line and it's just going to add re before the subject line so that it looks like you're following up on your previous email. But if you want to force the software to use the subject line that you're putting over here, there is an option for that as well. So that's why we are putting a subject line in case we do not want to use our previous subject line, right? So the subject line is over here, the copy is over here, but make sure to fix the macro. For the macro, you need to have double braces. A lot of people make this mistake. So I want to highlight this for sure. Hi, you know, have the double macros. You will get all the macros from here. And if you choose the list to whom you want to send these emails, you'll be getting all the macro option. So based on what list you're choosing, you'll be getting the macros from here. So now if you're happy with the copy, just name it as follow up one and you can save this template. That's it. So this is the first copy follow up one, follow up two. That's how we create as many follow ups as we want. And in the next video, I will show you how you use Gromeo Organic to launch your campaign. This whole video is a part of a cool email masterclass. So if you haven't checked it out, make sure to check out the playlist of cold email masterclass in the description below. And if you want to get access to this cold outreach chat GPT prompt, make sure to hit like once we reach 50 likes or 10 comments, I'm going to make this live on the description and the comment. But if you want to get the early access, make sure to join our premium Gromeo organic community, which is right now completely free. You get the access of our Gromeo organic community in the description below. Join the community, get access to such chat GPT prompt, code email hacks, and a bunch of freebies that you'll find inside our community. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.